right guys i'm playing call of duty mobile on samsung galaxy z fold 5 and i want to test this game with the dualsense controller so as call of duty mobile it's gonna start up i need to just put this down a little bit because it's gonna be loud right so this is call of duty mobile i'm gonna i want to use the dualsense controller on this it does work with game pads but every time i've ever tried this it has never worked the two games that I have tried, the DualSense controller, the PS5 gamepad, that work with the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5, is Fortnite and War Robots. Yes, I know what you're thinking. War Robots? Yes, War Robots works with the gamepad. I just found that out today. I didn't know that it was possible. I If, if I had known it was possible, because listen, with this big screen, I can lie on my bed, I can just play games. That means I don't need my Steam Deck anymore. <laughs> no, I need my Steam Deck. I'm just joking. I play a lot of games on Steam Deck, but I'm just saying that I'm amazed that uh, the DualSense controller does work uh, with your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. You've got a Z Fold 5 and your board, you've got nothing else to do. You've got a DualSense controller uh, from your PlayStation 5 and you're not using, if you've got more than one, yeah? And uh, you've got more than one gamepad and it's not doing anything, then connect it to your Samsung Z Fold 5, just going to Bluetooth, pair them. And uh, remember, press the PlayStation logo and the share, which is next to the D-pad, until it flickers blue, and then connect it, pair it. That's all you got to do. And once it's recognized, it's recognized for forever. And whenever you've got your pad there, of course, it will go off if you're not using it on standby. Just press on the uh, PlayStation logo, and it will reconnect to your Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. So that's what I'm saying. If you see it's not connected, it's because you need to press the PlayStation logo. If it's not working entirely, like it's not even turning on, just connect the the connect it to a cable, to a USB cable. Because nine out of ten times, your PlayStation Five gamepad is uh, dead on the battery, so the battery is low. I mean, the battery is very low, so obviously it's not gonna work if the battery is you know completely gone, is it? It's not the gamepad; it's not working. It's working. It just needs to be powered on or whatever, you know. Just connect it to your cable. And it should be able to power it on. Right, so what's this video about? Um, Call of Duty Mobile does work on the phone, uh, on the controls, yes? Touch controls. I don't want to use touch controls. I want to play this using a DualSense controller. So I need to find out, man, this thing. I need to find out how I can connect it to a controller. Because every time, listen, every time I've tried this myself, I have never gotten this to work uh, the way I want it to work. It says audio and graphics sensitivity. Where's the um, the controller, the gamepad? Oh yeah, oh no, this guy is asking me to join him. Controller. Uh, let's see, how do you get it to connect? Ah, it says settings. It says connect. So there you go. I've pressed it. Uh, to pay your control with your Bluetooth devices. Please pay your controller with your device via Bluetooth. You know one thing? I've already done this. It hasn't done much in the game. Is it working? No. Look, there's nothing. There's nothing going on. That's what bores me the most about this game. It says to, 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 to pair it. And it is paired. You know, it's paired, right? But it doesn't work on this game. Wait, there's stuff in here that I haven't... What's going on? Oh, is this new stuff? Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff in here. Oh, damn. Wait, man. I'm trying to download some stuff. Okay, these are going down quickly. I'm just wondering, like, are these new maps or something? Okay, so these maps, it says Zombies, Icebreaker, Haunted uh, As ha Hacienda, uh, and Dead Siege. It says uh, Nuketown, Year, Year of the Rabbit. So I think these are like being updated. They look like night maps. It says the club. I've never played the club. Uh, Memos, uh, Memnos Island. Standoff. Uh, well, all of these I think are there. But I've not seen these other ones. These look like night maps. <sighs> I think Icebreaker has been there before, right? Uh, zombies, Sims New, Undead Siege. Uh, Nuketa, Nuketown, Year of the Rabbit, and the Haunted Hacienda. I think those are new maps. I think Icebreaker was there from before. I think that's just be, um, getting an update. Man, this is taking a long time to do. 
No, I'm I'm just saying I want to see if the the gamepad doesn't work with this thing. That's the problem. I mean, I can I don't need the gamepad. I can just use my, you know, the old way, you know, the touchscreen way. But it would have been nicer if the gamepad worked, you know. Because it does say it supports a gamepad. But I'm just like wondering like why doesn't it, you know, let me do anything? Is do I have to be in the game for that to happen? Right, so it's just downloading the maps now, guys. It's, it's completed the other stuff. Weapons and operators have been updated. It's just updating the maps. It's about, yeah, it's completed now. It's finished. Uh, let's get into a game. Right, it's showing a bit of a video. I don't know what that is. It says Halloween series Armory, but Halloween's gone, right? Right, so the problem is, you see, there's nothing happening. So how do I know if this is connected? I don't think it's connected. That's the problem. How do you connect a DualSense controller to your phone if you're using uh, Call of Duty? I will be testing this on uh, PUBG. Uh, I don't think it's going to work with the gamepad. Um, I'm not saying it doesn't work. It clearly says that it works with the gamepad. It says connect this with Bluetooth. The problem is it is connected. It's connected to my Samsung, but it won't let me use the game, this DualSense. So is there something that I'm doing wrong or what? Does it want me to do a complete um, re, uh, re, re, reconnect this or something? This would have been so much nicer if I could use the gamepad. It's, it's not connected. It's, it ain't connected. There no movement. I can't, move, I can't do anything. That's a pity. This video would have been so much more interesting. Anyway, got to go the old-fashioned way and use the touch screen. I mean, I, I don't mind using it this way. Oh, my God. I got shot. <laughs> okay, I'm not the first kill, but the other team is clearly... Oh, my God. What? I'm getting annihilated. Right, let's let's try. Let's try. Oh, please, don't, don't kill me. What is going on? What is happening? How, how are we getting annihilated like this? Oh my god, there's a dude that come on. Man, this sucks. Right. I'm not I'm usually not this bad guys. So that's why I'm like, is it because I'm coming from What the hell? Did you see that? I'm just getting hit. I've never died this quickly before. <laughs> that's why I'm wondering. No, you know, you know what I think this is? I think it's because I was playing that other game. And I and I may have gone used to the fact uh, that I was oh my god that was I was using a controller and now you know you're coming from the controller back to the touch screen it's a bit of a pain man you should have seen the you should have seen the way I was playing yesterday I wish I'd made a recording yesterday I was annihilating people <laughs> I was annihilating them you know but now. I, I don't I don't blame the game. I think what's happening. What? What the hell? Man. Okay, I think it's because I was playing a different game. But uh that could be an excuse as well. I'm just like why am I losing? You know what I think we're just fighting a good team. <laughs> That's the second time I've died. My god! No, man, this is one of my favorite games, and I'm getting annihilated like it's a joke, like it's a joke thing, you know, like a joke thing, I'm getting hit like a joke, this is madness, what, look at this dude, he just ran into the house, this guy ran into the house, let's see, where is he at, is he, where is he, oh my god, Oh, we got those ones. All right. Uh, we're not doing too bad. One twenty-seven versus 36. But clearly, these guys are annihilating us in a bad, bad, bad way. Man, come on. Come on. Come on. Ah, but we managed. I managed to draw us back to 31. We've, we've lost. <laughs> we lost by nine. We lost by nine people. This is madness. Right, um, so the whole point of this video was to see if I could connect the, um, the Jolson's controller to 
the um, to the um, Z Fold 5, which did not work out the way I wanted it to. So that's a pity. I'm just gonna jump out of the game. I'm going to make another video. I'm gonna make a video now about PUBG. Um, like I said, my videos right now are not about the games that I'm playing. I can play any game on this, but I want to see which games work with this dude here. The last game, obviously, will be Fortnite. I was playing Fortnite on my Switch, so I need to jump out of the Switch. Uh, because, obviously, if you're playing it on this console, like I said, um, like I said, if you're playing it on one of the consoles, it'll kick me out of the other one. The account that I use for Fortnite here and there is the same same account. Right, so I'm going to make a, a video about PUBG, guys.